What's going on, my amazing people? I hope you're having a wonderful day. So what do you say we get to work? Let's dive into vanilla item retextures and tweaks. And as usual, we're gonna start with that separator. So I'm gonna go ahead and copy this right here. Go into the tiny wrench spanner right over here. Create separator, paste it, and click OK. All right, let's do it. All right, a medium born Blade of Woe. This mod is a texture replacer for the Blade of Woe. Classic mod, legendary mod, let's do it. All right, let's click on files and we're gonna want the main file right here. All right, now let's install it. Boom, okay. Activate it and move on. A median born book of silence, a large collection of high resolution replacements for Skyrim textures, including mini armors, weapons, etc. Yeah, it's a testament to uh, how good this mod is. This is one of those old school mods that just won't go away. So let's go and download it. So we want book of silence, CCOR, content, add on, main file. So click on files. And right here, we want the second option here mod manager download. Boom, boom, boom. Yeet. One gig download speed. All right, get comfortable, y'all. Okay, that took a little bit. So um, there's gonna be some files here that we're gonna delete, or in my case, I'm just not gonna install them in the first place. Uh, by now, you know me, if there's no full mod, um, I prefer just not to install these things instead of just installing it and then opening it up and deleting it. So let me show you how I do. Double click. Now I'm going to click on manual and we're going to start from the top. Uh, oh, it's a BSA. You know what? Never mind what I just said. <laughs> we have to extract this BSA before you even have access to this. So just in install it. <laughs> I was being all show off like and all that. I was so impressed with myself. <laughs> all right. <laughs> yes. Extract that BSA. All right. From here, right click, open it up. And now let's delete this stuff. So let's go into textures, uh, actors, DLC uh, 01, and we're going to get rid of Dragon Freeze Acolyte, delete, and we're going to get rid of Hulking Draugr, get rid of that. Uh, right, and also we're going to get rid of Storm Achenok, Kapow, gone. All right, now we're going to go up one layer, one layer, yeah, one level, click on actors here, boop. And now we're going to get rid of Dragon Priest, goodbye Dragon Priest, get rid of Draugr. Get rid of Farmer, get rid of Skeleton, and get rid of Spriggan. Excellent. That's that. All right, let's activate that and move on. A median born content add on SE. This file provides support for the texture variations included in this mod. So let's do it. Click on download, and let's download the main file here. Boom, boom, boom. Good, good. And now install it. Okay. All right, so now we're gonna go Medium Born Book of Silence Armors, optional file, SE Armors, version 1.9.1. .1. So we'll go into files, optional file, and here's Armors, the very first option here, 1.9.1, .1, yes. All right, I'm gonna leave this open. I have a feeling we're gonna download several things from this page. And this is a pretty big download too, a little over 600 megabytes. I don't know why I'm pulling out the Southern accent so much tonight. I'm a weirdo. Okay, let's install it. Double click. There's a foam mod. Open up the foam mod. We're gonna go with custom. Oh yes, custom. Next. Next. All right, iron and banded. We're gonna go with none. Steel, we're gonna go with none. Steel plate, we're not gonna check that box. Leather, you know what? I'm gonna open this up. There we go. Uh, leather, nope. Hide and studded, none for all right, nothing here so far. Next, let me scroll down here. So we're looking from fur to wolf. So uh, Elvin, we do want Elvin. We're gonna go with dark default. We're not changing anything else here. Click next here. Now let's look from wolf on down. So we want wolf, gray fur, glass, nothing. And that's pretty much it, install. Only a handful of stuff. Ooh, I forgot to rename this. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just click rename and I'm gonna name it here, this. Yeah, we don't want to merge it. Do not merge it. So, our merge. Boom. Okay. All right. Okay, next up. Medium born hide and studded hide. No, that's not the page we we're going to go anyway. All right, so click on download. Boom. Files. 
Uh, do we want Ultra? No, we don't want Ultra. We want the first option, version two. All right, good. Double click to install, okay. And activate that. Medium born Imperial Light and Studded. This modern texture replacer for Imperial Light and Studded. Okay, we want the 2K version. Files download. 2K version is the first option here. Let's download that. And let's install it. Double click. All right. Activate that. Now we're moving on to medium born iron and banded iron. 2K version. 2K version is the first option, but there's cable cut and vanilla cut. Which one do we want? We want the iron cable cut. That's the first option here. Good. Double click to install that. Okay. Activate that. Medium born scaled armor. We want version two. Download. Only one version here. All right, great, great. Double click. Moving right along. All right, so we a medium born storm cloak officer armor. Let's download that. Files. And I think we just want the first option here. Yeah. yeah. Click to install that. Very nice. All right, we're going with uh, Codorex Accoutrement Patches. This mod added, it adds various patches, and we just want the improved closed faced helmets and WACCF. And that's the second option here. We're going to go with the second option Mod Manager Download. And let's name it accordingly so we know exactly which patch this is. Click OK. Going to activate that. All right, Apophysis, Dragon Priest Mask. I see we got an optional file and a main file. The optional file is listed first, so we're going to use, we're going to install that first. And we're going to install these as separate mods. So let's go with the main file, our optional file that we're going to install as the main file first. So we want the loose version here. Mod Manager Download. And we want the extras, I believe. Extra Apophysis, Apophysis. Boom. Very good. Now let's install the main file first, or what we're treating as the main file first. And I'm gonna rename it, just so I know. Loose, excellent. All right, and then the extras patch. Drop down, call it extra. Yes, all right. And that's the load order that we want, guys. So make sure you install the loose and then the extra. Good. Lean Wolf's Better Shaped Weapons. Download this. Uh, do we want the main version here? 2.1.03. Yep. All right. That's downloaded. And let's look at this full mod. What are we looking at? We're going to install everything. Next. Next. See the options. We want both of these. Next. Next. Patches. We don't need no sticking patches. Next. Next. And nothing here either. Next. Next. No refraction. Click that. Good. Moving on. Next. Anything for Dawnbreaker. We want the Dawnbreaker Sheath Elf version. Next. Next. Dawnbreaker EMB options. We want the ENB option. Next. Next. Dragon Bone options. We're going to go with Dragon Boring Weapons. First option there. Good. Next. Next. And left hand meshes. No dual sheath. Install. Very good. All right. Activate this. Now we're going to do Elven Weapons for Silence. If I remember correctly, this actually looks really cool. So we're going to go with the optional files, the Dark Obsidian. Very nice. Boop, come on. Uh, right here. First option under optional files, Dark Obsidian. Oh, so nice. All right, let's install it. Okay. Good, good. Great sword sheaths and scabbards redux. Add scabbards and sheaths. Two-handed style. Let's do it. Files. What the main file, right? Yep. Very good. Now let's double click to install this. Oh, there's a full mod. Let's look at that full mod. Uh, mesh types, we're gonna go with thin. Sheaths and scabbard types, we're gonna go with full size. Skyforge shield, yes, I'll take that. Install. Activate that. Very good. Ebony Weapons 2017 Reek Texture. Okay, so we got a main file, optional file. Okay. Super Ultimate Lower Friendly. Very cool. Version 1.5. Run the files. Download the main file here. 
And with the better shape weapons, weapons quiver. Yes. So download the first option here, Cactus Ebony. Yeah. I'm doubting myself so much. Okay, here we go. Boom. All right, so I got a thing going on here. How my download seems to have uh, just sort of lagged here, lagged out. This is how you fix this. Right click, pause it, then double click it. And it gets the motor running. All right, let's install them. We're gonna install these as separate mods. So first one, I'm good with that name. Okay. And now the, uh, uh, the, the, the Cactus Ebony, Better Shape Weapons Quiver, etc. Let's rename it Cactus Ebony. Good, okay. Activate these. Let's clear this out, huh? Right click, delete, install, downloads. Yes. All right, now we're moving on to Rustic Armors and Weapons. Yeah, this is really cool. Rustic Armor Weapons Special Edition High Res Retexture for Selected armor, Armors and Weapons. So we're gonna install the 4K-2K and we're gonna delete, looks like a folder here. So let's do it. Download, files, 4K-2K, that's the last option. Download dot. And it's, it's hung again. Interesting, right click, pause, double click. There you go. So now let's install it, but we don't want to install this Blade of Woe stuff. So manual, click, go into textures, go into weapons, and there's Blade of Woe, untick that box, okay. There we go, moving on, activate. Frankly, HD Dongard armor and weapons. This is a mod, is a high resolution texture for Dongard stuff. Let's install it. Files. And I think we just want the main file, right? Yes. Download the main file. Excellent. Stop hanging, Nexus. Why are you doing this to me? Right click, pause. I will show you. Uh, take that. <laughs> All right, though. Let's install it. Oh, there's a full mod. Open that up. We're going to go with the 2K version and then install. Good. Activate that. Frankly, HD Nightingale Armor and Weapons main file and an optional file. High resolution retexture for uh, Nightingale weapons and armor. So we want the main file here and what's the optional? Uh, better shape weapons dual, and dual sheath. All right, good. So we're gonna go to bus. All right, download the main file. And let's look for that. Here it is right here. Very last option. Lean, lean Wolf's better shaped weapons and dual sheath three ducks. Bam. All right, now let's install it. Main file first. Let's open up this full mod. We're gonna go with the 2K resolution. Next, next. We're gonna go with a full glove. Install. And then activate that. Now let's install that uh, patch or whatever this is. So let's go down to Lean Wolf's Better Shape Weapons and Dual Sheath Three Ducks. Good. Activate that. Now we're going to go with uh, Gemling Queen Jewelry. This mod aims to replace all jewelry gemstones with actual transparency and depth. That sounds very cool. So we're going to install it and we're going to delete this ESP right here. So let's let's do it. Download. Files. Mod Manager download. Good. Double click to install it. And let's look at this full mod. Okay, so we want amulets, circlets, and rings. We want the Dongard add-on. We want the Dongard unobtainable items. Next, next, amulet texture options. We want to go with Gambwich amulet textures, 1024. Next, next, let's open this up. Oh, much better. First area here, we're going to go with Gambwich ring textures combined, 1K. Optional mesh packs, none. And we don't want the vampire beast thingy. Install it. All right, now let's get rid of that ESP. So I'm going in here, opening an explorer, and we're going to delete that. Good. Activate. All right. Circlet USEP fixes. This mod fixes the problem that circlet mods don't work well with USEP. Now well, we'll show USEP files. And um, yeah, which one do we want? <laughs> USEP circlet fix. USEP circlet fix. First option, guys. Boom. And now double click to install it. Good. Activate that. Improve close face helmets. This was the, I think this was the first mod I had ever downloaded when I was playing Legendary Edition. Cause I noticed that you couldn't see the eyes of anyone wearing helmets. I was like, that's, I don't like that. So I sought out this mod. And back then it was actually separated in like three different mods, I think. 
Skyrim, Dawn Guard, and Dragonborn. Yeah. All right. Let's install it. Enough reminiscing, JT. Files, Mod Manager download. I have a sneaky suspicion that this... Nah, that's not who I think it is. Forget it. Forget I said anything. Install it. Okay. And we're going to extract that BSA, guys. Yes. Good. Activate that. Apophysis DPM. Approve close base helmets for Apophysis. ICH patch. Let's download it. Files. Mod manager. Mod manager download. Now let's install it. I'm good with that name. Okay. New jewels for circlets. This mod replaces the Onyx and Moonstone gems textures only when combined with Gimling uh, Queen jewelry. Let's download the main file. Grayscale, normal, and grayscale. Files. And we want the second option here. Boom. Double click to install that. Okay. And now let's activate it. Rustic Clothing Special Edition. This mod is a high resolution clothing texture overhaul for Skyrim. Yes, this is a essential mod to me. Let's download that. Files. We're going to go with the 2K. I think back in the, uh, at one point, I think Lexi's got actually installed the 4K. But uh, I agree, 2K is all that's needed. I could be wrong. Here we go. Double click to install it. Okay. All right. Activate that. Now we're moving on to Frankly HD Stormcloak and City Guards. We've got a main file and an update file. Since that's an update file, we're going to merge it into the main file. Let's do it. Okay, go to files and the main file. Did we want 2K or 4K? We want the 2K. Boom. Now let's get the update file. Fix for sprites. Spriter San. Fix for Spriter San 2K version. Good. Boom. All right. Install the main file first. Boom. That's the name we want. Now let's install the fix. Keep that name. Okay. Then merge. Bam. Stormcloak Armor Revival. This is a high quality texture replacer for Stormcloak Soldiers uniforms. 2K version, guys. Download. Files. 2K version is the first uh, option here. Mod Manager download. And let's install it. Okay. Boom. All right, moving on to Sigils of Skyrim Shields. This is a high quality texture replacer for all the Hold Shield Sigils. Main file, shields. Good. Let's download it. Files. Not banners, but shields. Boom. Now let's install it. And let's make sure it's named properly. Sigils of Skyrim Shields. All right. Okay. Okay. Then finally, we're installing Frankly HD Thieves Guild Armors. Yep, let's do it. Version 1. Files. Mod Manager download. Alright, this is going to be a full mod. Double click. I'm guessing 2K, right? Right, 2K. Install it. Activate that. Right click here, delete install downloads. Over here, collapse that. And that, as they say, is that. I'm gonna end the video there. It's running um, longer than I'm comfortable comfortable with, but I didn't wanna break up vanilla item retextures into two videos. So um, thank you for joining me. Um, I hope you're getting some value out of this video series and I'll see you in the next one with armor conversions, woo!